Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Sean from TechDrawDollars.com. You do come to Slim Pete. And I just wanted to do a quick video to, for you guys today, just showing you um, how to get a Nexus 7 unstuck um, from this boot screen. So it's been on this boot screen for probably about the past five minutes, and I've been experiencing this issue from time to time, especially sometimes the screen will just freeze up. Um, one way to get it to restart is to hold the power button on the right side and just keep holding it down until the device completely turns off and then restarts. Um, if it's stuck and you can't, you know, toggle the power on screen or the screen won't work, just hold, keep holding the power button down for about 10 seconds and it'll restart to this screen. Once you're on this screen, um, if it gets stuck like this, um, just tap the sides gently, or tap the sides lightly, so like the right and the left sides. It's one of the sides, but I can't remember exactly which one it is. And then we're going to turn it back over. And there you go. Now it's booting in. And the explanation that I got for this was that somewhere in inside the hardware on the left or the right panel um, side of the device, there's like an accelerometer switch. And basically that switch um, sometimes gets stuck in a certain orientation. So by applying light force to it, we'll un, um, we'll you know get the uh, get the switch unstuck, and then that'll allow the device to boot properly. Um, so I guess it's kind of confused whether it should be booting in portrait or landscape orientation um, because the switch is out of sync. Um, but by tapping it, we'll you know unclog that up. This is a known problem. Many Nexus Sevens have it. Um, so it's a known problem for Google. Definitely, if you're within your one-year manufacturing period, I would recommend um, you know getting it swapped out um, if you can. However, the only thing is that um, you know a lot of these devices are getting older, so they don't really have the uh, you don't really have that manufacturer warranty left on them. But it is a known problem. Um, definitely, if you're if you're annoyed by doing this, I would contact Google and see if there's anything that they can do as far as giving you a replacement. Um, as far as giving you a replacement uh, device, because it is a known issue with the Nexus 7. Anyways, guys, that was just a quick tutorial on how to fix your Nexus 7 if it's stuck um, and you can't get it booted up. Um, hope you guys like the video. Please subscribe to my channel um, and also thumbs up if this worked out and helped you. Um, I'll talk to you guys in a later video. You guys have a nice day. Goodbye.